Plasticity 3D's recent update has brought a significant set of enhancements and features that continue to push its capabilities as a versatile tool for precision 3D modeling. This version builds upon the software's core strengths, particularly in NEBS-based modeling, while refining its user experience and expanding its functionality. In this video, we will dive into the specifics of what the new update offers, including interface improvements, performance optimizations, expanded file format support, enhanced modeling tools and new features for curve and surface manipulation. One of the standout aspects of the recent update is the revamped user interface, designed with a focus on making the software more intuitive and adaptable to individual workflows. The interface improvements aim to streamline the modeling process, reducing the time it takes for users to access the tools they need. Users can now easily customize their workspace, allowing for the adjustment of panels, toolbars, and menus to create a layout that suits their particular style of work. This customization is particularly useful for users transitioning from other 3D modeling platforms like Blender or Fusion 360, who may be looking for a more familiar layout. By allowing the repositioning of tools and adjusting the user interface to individual preferences, Plasticity 3D makes it easier for new users to get up to speed while giving seasoned users more efficient workflow. The streamlined interface is also designed to be less cluttered, ensuring that the focus remains on the modeling area while keeping frequent used tools readily accessible. Plasticity 3D has always been known for its lightweight nature compared to more resource-intensive CAD software, and the recent update further enhances its performance. One of the key areas of improvement is in handling larger, more complex models with a higher number of surfaces and curves. The update includes optimizations that reduces lag and improve responsiveness when working with dense geometries. This means that users can manipulate complex models such as detailed product design or architectural layout without experiencing significant slowdowns. For professionals working on intricate designs where performance can be a critical factor, these optimizations make a noticeable difference. Whether it's adjusting curves on a high-resolution model or refining the details of a surface, the new update ensures that plasticity remains smooth and responsive. This makes the software a more viable option for users who may have previously turned to more powerful workstations or higher-end CAD programs to handle their demanding projects. The ability to move 3D models between different software platforms is crucial in many industries, and the new update has improved plasticity interoperability through expanded file format support. New file formats have been added, including better support for CAD standards such as STEP and IGES, as well as improvements to existing exports like OBJ and FBX. This makes it easier to integrate plasticity into various design pipelines, whether the end goal is rendering, 3D printing, or further editing in softwares like Rhinoceros 3D, Blender, or Maya. For example, designers can now use plasticity to create detailed NEPS models and then export them to other software for more advanced rendering or animation. The improved .xtep export ensures that models retain their precision and smoothness when transferred to CAD programs used in engineering or manufacturing processes. This expanded compatibility makes plasticity a more versatile tool for professionals who need to work across multiple software environments, ensuring that models created in plasticity retain their integrity and precision throughout the workflow. One of the most exciting additions in the new update is the improvement to curve manipulation tools, providing users with more flexibility and control when creating and editing curves. These tools are crucial for creating smooth complex surfaces in NEPS modeling allowing designers to define the exact curvature and flow of their models. The update introduces a more refined curve editing mode, enabling users to create, adjust, and align curves with greater precision. This is particularly beneficial in fields like automotive and aerospace design, where the aerodynamics of a surface can depend on the subtle control of curves. Users can adjust curvature, control point, and tangent with high degree of accuracy, making it possible to create smooth transitions and complex 
shapes that are difficult to achieve with standard polygonal modeling. Additionally, the new snapping feature in the curve manipulation tool allows for better alignment of curves and surfaces, making it easier to create symmetrical design and precise adjustment. This is particularly useful for designers working on mechanical parts where exact measurements are critical. These improvements help make the process of defining the shape and structure of model more intuitive, reducing the time spent on fine-tuning and adjustment. Alongside the improvements to curve manipulation, Plasticity 3D has introduced new surface editing tools that provide more options for shaping and refining nerve surfaces. The update includes enhancements to surface trimming and blending functions, allowing users to seamlessly join, cut, and blend surfaces with greater accuracy. This is particularly useful for creating complex transitions between surfaces, such as blending the body of a car with its aerodynamic fins or merging organic shapes in industrial design. These enhanced surface tools makes it easier to model objects with smooth continuous surfaces, reducing the need for manual adjustment and making the software more capable of handling intricate design challenges. Designers can now create more fluid shapes with fewer artifacts or irregularities, which is crucial for maintaining a high level of detail in final models. This is especially beneficial in product design, where surface quality can directly impact the manufacturing process and the final appearance of a product. The new update also brings more robust snapping and alignment features, making it easier to place objects precisely within the 3D space. This is an essential aspect of CAD-like modeling, where components often need to be aligned accurately relatively to each other. The improved snapping system in Plasticity 3D allows for easier placement of objects along curves surfaces as well as better control over aligning edges and vertices. These enhancements makes it easier to maintain consistency in complex models, such as aligning parts in mechanical assembly or ensuring that architectural elements are positioned correctly. For those working on projects where precise measurements are crucial, these snapping and alignment updates can greatly speed up the modeling process and reduce errors, making the software more efficient for professional use. The new Plasticity 3D has also focused on improving user documentation and expanding the available learning resources. As the software's user base has grown, so has the need for more accessible guides and tutorials to help new users get the most out of the software. The new update has introduced more in-depth documentation, covering the use of new features and providing detailed examples of how to implement advanced modeling techniques. This enhanced documentation is especially valuable for new users who may be transitioning from other platforms or learning NEPS based modeling for the first time. It also serves experienced users who want to explore the newer tools in the update more thoroughly. With these resources, Plasticity aims to foster a more informed user community, helping to reduce the software's learning curve and empower users to take full advantage of newer updates. Recent updates made into Plasticity 3D represent a significant step forward in the software's development, offering enhancements that refine its usability, expand its capability, and improve its integration with other industry tools. With a more intuitive interface, improved performance for handling large models, and advanced tools for curve and surface manipulation, Plasticity has become an even more compelling choice for those who need precise, efficient modeling. These updates make Plasticity 3D a more competitive option in the landscape of 3D modeling software, bridging the gap between traditional CAD program and artist-focused 3D tools. Whether users are designing complex products for manufacturing, creating intricate 3D prints, or simply exploring new creative possibilities, this and upcoming Plasticity 3D update will offer a robust platform with the power and flexibility to meet their needs. Okay, if you love this video, kindly don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and until my next video, peace.